Hello and welcome. I'm Igor from Integra Audio, a channel focused on audio plugin reviews. If you're interested in that kind of stuff, please make sure to subscribe. Welcome back, guys. Today we're gonna take a look at a very interesting plugin from FabFilter and it's the updated version of the Volcano, the Volcano 3. Volcano 3 is an EQ filter with some modulation options. This plugin goes very deep, but we're gonna just scrape the surface of it and go over some of the features on the Volcano 3. Now if you take a look at the GUI, you can notice it's also well presented and pretty like expected from FabFilter. It is resizable and it has full screen mode. FabFilter animations always amaze me as their plugins are always smooth as butter. This time around it's no different, the plugin is really neatly organized and easy to learn. First off, let's talk about the knobs in this display here. So the first knob starting from the left would be the filter drive knob. It controls the overall input drive of the filter. With the input drive you can control how clean or saturated or distorted your signal will sound. So let's take a listen. Next to it would be the main knob with the frequency parameters and filter panning, which we can also automate and modulate. And here we have the filter peak knob which controls the peak or resonance of the filter. And here we have the filter slope switch, which controls the steepness of the filter slope. In this area here, we have the delay and the level knobs. The delay knob is used to delay the filtered signal from 0 up to 50 milliseconds. And the level knob controls the output level of the filter. And also we have the filter output pan which can be also modulated.
One amazing thing about this plugin is its ability to modulate and route stuff. Everything you see here can be modulated and or routed. And I've got here some free multitracks from Cambridge Music Technology website and we're gonna try and apply some Volcano 3 effects on these instruments. Lastly, let's check out these presets. This can be very useful for starting out and giving you an idea of what the plugin is capable of. Some of these are really cool. So let's take a listen. Oh. 
Very cool effects and modulation. And well, that will be it for today's video. Thank you for watching. If you stay till the end, please make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you get notified when we post a video. This has been Igor and I'll see you in another one. Peace out.